Yo, what's happening, guys? Hope you all are doing well. You are having a great day. And this is Tito back with another video. And today is a different day. And today I'm gonna flash the Pixel Experience ROM, which is based on Android 8.1. And this is the first 8.1 ROM for our device. So without further delay, let's do this. First of all, you need to go to this website to download the ROM which will be linked below in the description box. You won't need anything else like gapps because it's included inside the ROM already. Well, let me tell you in this video I have flashed the older build that's why I will flash the ROM file and the boot image file. But on the latest build you will only need to flash the ROM file, nothing else. I shot the whole video on Sunday 10th of December. But my PC broke down, that is why I am editing this video today on Wednesday morning. This is why this video got delayed almost 3 days, so I am really sorry guys. So as you can see, I am on line choice right now. So let's boot the phone into TWRP recovery. Once we are booted into TWRP recovery, go to wipe, then advanced wipe, now wipe cache, Dalvik cache, system and data. Once done, go back, go back, I am on official TWRP 3.0.2.2, I will recommend you using this recovery. Go to install, locate the ROM file and swipe to confirm flash. You won't need any gapps file for this ROM. Once done, you can just reboot the system from here. But in the previous build, we had to flash the boot image separately. So here is how to do this. Even with this process, you can update your TWRP with TWRP. Just in case you are wondering, just select the recovery option instead of boot if you are into that. Here we have the amazing boot animation of Android 8.1. Now let me set everything up from here. In the meantime, let's talk what's working and what not here. Geo 4G Vault DE, mobile data, Wi-Fi, camera, fingerprint sensor, torch, everything is working super fine, no issues whatsoever. But do note that Godix fingerprint sensor is not yet working. For 8.1, we have a proper Oreo biscuit icon here. Previously, we had the yellow and round icon on 8.0. These are the 15 stock apps this ROM comes preloaded with, except the MX Player and UC Browser. It's there because I just restored my Google App Data Backup. Now let me take some quick pictures. Both rear and front cameras are working fine here for me. Here is a demo of Geo 4G Vault E calling working. Welcome to Geo Bangla Chono. Add people. Hindi ke liye so dabai. To continue in English, press 3. We have the latest power options shifted to the right, I mean close to the power button, but previously it used to be on the middle of the screen. Here is the rebooting animation for 8.1. 
Now let's talk what's not working here. Well, you may think I am being nitpicky here, but it's my job to let you guys know everything, right? Well, we can't disable heads up notifications on this ROM yet. Settings search used to force close, but on the latest build, this issue is fixed now. One more thing, pressing and holding the home button doesn't get you to Google Assistant, but saying OK Google does. And there are no separate buttons customization settings that I found. I like this slowly immersive nightlight animation here. As I have been using this ROM since 2 days, I gotta say the ROM is super stable, smooth and the battery life is just great here. Here is an example for that. What are the things new in Android 8.1? Well, there are very little things which are added here, but they are great all the way. If you look closely, you can see notification drawer is little transparent now, and there is a bluish hue in the blank area, and the icons like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. are a little rounded on the edges when compared to the previous Android versions. So to sum it up, I would say this ROM is pretty much a must try if you are an Android nerd like me and you have a Redmi Note 3. And a huge thanks to the developer for making this ROM for our device. So that wraps up this video guys, hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel right here because many more awesome contents like this will be coming shortly. And this is Tito from Carry and Day signing off. Thank you for watching. Bye bye now.